Number 7. Polestar 4 The Swedish EV maker is preparing another all-electric crossover. This time, we are looking forward to a sportier and more affordable model than the Polestar 3. With its coupe-like silhouette, this model will aim at buyers who look for a combination of style and functionality, but also want competitive performance at a reasonable price. That's why the base single motor Polestar 4 will start at around $60,000. For that money, you will get a stylish and luxurious SUV with strong overall performance. The electric motor is good for about 272 horsepower and comes with a 94 kilowatt battery, which should ensure around 300 miles of charge. The twin motor version is expected to cost around $80,000, and for that money, you will get two times more power and the ability to hit 60 in just 3.8 seconds. It will come with the same 94 kilowatt battery, so the max range should be a little bit shorter. As for the charging speed, the company promises a pretty decent 200 kilowatt rate. The Polestar 4 will hit the market in 2024 as the 2025 model. Number 6. Chevrolet Equinox EV If you look at most of the new and upcoming EVs, they aren't just incredibly quick and with respectable range. They also tend to be luxurious. As a result, most of them are way too expensive for an average buyer. The all-electric Equinox will be completely the opposite. It will be an EV designed for the masses with a starting price that isn't much higher compared to the conventional gas-powered Equinox. Does this mean it will compromise on performance or range? Not at all. The new compact crossover will offer quite decent performance, already with the base single electric motor version. That model will feature a 210 horsepower unit mounted on the front axle, while the dual motor version will feature all-wheel drive and a max output of 290 horsepower. Besides respectable acceleration, this crossover will offer a respectable range. Base models will feature a smaller battery that ensures up to 250 miles of range, while the available bigger battery will provide up to 300 miles on a single charge. Besides capacity, both batteries will feature more than decent charging speed. With the ability to add 70 miles of range in just 10 minutes, we expect that the all-electric Equinox will hit the market already by the end of this year, with a starting price at around $30,000. Number 5. Volvo EX30 The EX30 just had a premiere, and we learned some pretty amazing things about it. This will be the smallest and cheapest, but also the quickest Volvo you can buy. With the sticker price expected around $34,000, it will be cheaper than the XC40, but at the same time, it will be able to hit 60 in less than 3.5 seconds. With 166.7 inches in total length, this will indeed be a small vehicle, but range-topping models will feature a duo of electric motors with a total output of 422 horsepower. As we just mentioned, that's enough for a 0-60 sprint in just 3.4 seconds. For those who don't necessarily need such impressive performance, a single motor version with 268 horsepower will be standard. And even with this setup, the new EX30 will be able to hit 60 in about 5 seconds. The EX30 will be configurable, not just in terms of power, but also in terms of battery capacity. Base models will feature a 51 kilowatt battery pack, which will ensure up to 200 miles of range. For those who need more than that, the optional 69 kilowatt battery will provide up to 270 miles per charge. Both batteries will perform very well when it comes to charging speed, and you will need less than 30 minutes to charge 80% of the battery with the DC charger. The production is expected to start later this year. Number 4. Mercedes-Benz EQE SUV The GLE has always been a gold standard among luxury midsize SUVs, and now it's time for a full electrification. Of course, it comes as a new member of the EQ family and, as you may presume, it shares a lot of parts with the EQE sedan, which already debuted a while ago. The first thing you'll notice is that the new electric SUV looks more rounded than the gas-powered counterpart. It looks mature, and more importantly, it comes packed with some serious technology. Three versions should be offered in the United States, starting from the base 288 horsepower single motor version. A four-wheel drive version will come with the same max output, despite the additional electric motor, while the EQE 500 will sit at the top of the offer. With the combined output of 402 horsepower in 0 to 60 time in 4 seconds flat, all three versions will come with the same 90.6 kilowatt battery pack, which will provide up to 279 miles of range. Besides decent autonomy, the EQE SUV will also offer competitive charging speeds, including the ability to charge 80% of the battery in just 32 minutes. Base models will cost around $79,000 while the range topping versions will most likely reach six figures. Overall, the EQE SUV looks fantastic, but still not good enough to be at the top of our list. So get ready, because the top three countdown starts right now. Number three, Kia EV9. 
So far, we have seen all kinds of electric cars. There were tons of sports cars, small crossovers, and capable off-roaders, but we haven't seen a genuine family hauler, a three-row SUV with strong performance and a reasonable price. That's exactly the mark of the new Kia EV9 is aiming at. This model will have all the features of a traditional midsize SUV, starting from three rows of seats and a large cargo area. On the other hand, it will come with a pretty capable powertrain. Base models will feature a single electric motor with 215 horsepower, while the dual motor version will be good for about 379 horsepower, enough to hit 60 in just 5.2 seconds. If that's not enough, the GT badge model is coming in 2025 with 576 horsepower. Along with sister company Hyundai, Kia is one of the industry leaders when it comes to battery technology. That's why it's not a surprise that this SUV will feature an 800-volt architecture, which will ensure impressive charging speeds, including the ability to add as much as 150 miles of range in only 15 minutes. Speaking of range, standard versions will use the 76.1 kilowatt battery, while the bigger 98.8 kilowatt battery package will be available. The latter will provide up to 300 miles on a single charge. The EV9 will hit the market by the end of the year, and we expect starting prices to go around $56,000. Number 2. Chevy Silverado EV While Ford was eager to launch an all-electric F-150 as quickly as possible, Chevy is taking its time to design a superior pickup in every aspect. According to the latest reports, the all-electric Silverado is almost here and should hit the market early next year. More importantly, the company promises some pretty serious performance. Just like the GMC Hummer EV, the new Silverado will use the Ultiman battery technology. However, instead of three, it will have two electric motors. This will make it more accessible to the masses, as the base work truck trim is expected to go around $44,000. Despite the price tag, already this model will feature impressive max output of 510 horsepower, while the more powerful setup will be good for 664 horsepower. Like the Hummer, this truck will also feature a 200 kilowatt battery, and the company already came up with a big statement that the max range will go all the way up to 450 miles, while the DC fast charging will ensure that 100 miles of range are added in every 10 minutes. We already know the initial models will be able to tow up to 10,000 pounds, but the company already promised a 20,000 pound version in the future. Number 1. Ram Revolution Just like Chevy, Ram is also developing its all-electric pickup at a steady pace. However, the company already promised a class-leading range, as well as class-leading towing capacity. Some of the specs have already been announced and we know that the base model will feature all-wheel drive, 654 horsepower, and a 168 kilowatt battery pack that should ensure 350 miles of range. All that will come with the sticker price of $58,000. Range topping models will feature a larger 229 kilowatt battery pack, which should provide 500 miles of range. Besides impressive autonomy, both batteries are expected to perform great in terms of charging speed. Thanks to the 350 kilowatt charging rate, this truck should be able to add 100 miles of range every 10 minutes. Traditionally, Ram will try to offer a more luxurious pickup than rivals. Besides a nice interior, we also expect superior ride quality, as adaptive air suspension will be available. Just like in the case of a gas-powered model, ride quality won't compromise towing capacity. The officials claim that the Ram Revolution will be able to tow up to 14,000 pounds, 4,000 pounds more than the F-150 Lightning and Silverado EV. If you're interested in the longest-range EVs, don't hesitate to click on this video. See you there!